Hello friends, in today's project, we will design a wireless interface board. So in this project, we need one Adreno Uno, one SC05 Bluetooth module, and a P10 display or 32 cross 16 LED DMD display. So this is your P10 display or some says that it's 32 cross 16 LED DMD display. It's having 512 LEDs in total and this board communicates with SPI communication. So we will be using SPI communication with Adreno to communicate and to display your wireless message over Bluetooth. So for wireless message we will be using an android phone to send your messages over bluetooth fine so this is your dmd display and this is your input section where you will provide input and see this one is your input and this is output it means you can connect multiple number of rows and column of this display and accordingly you can uh, define your number of display in the code section so that you can uh, design for uh, 5 cross 5 or 10 cross 2 whatever you your desired size you can design by this connection your input and output so let's connect our module to it you know you know See, I have made a connector for this PMD display and this connector, what it does, it converts your 16 pin to 7 pin so that your DMD will connect to this 16 pin side and it will connect and your Adeno will connect to the 7 pin side and this is your 7 pin. So, uh, means at D13, D11, D98 and D7, D6. This is your 7 pin and including your ground, it will be your 7 pin. So this is your 16 pin to 7 pin converter. So let's connect all the 7 pin to our Adeno. For connection, we need jumper wires. So friends, don't confuse that uh, uh, I'm connecting it randomly. So you just follow this circuit diagram, this circuit diagram, and connect the circuit, and you will you will be displaying all the things. Because since it's easy actually, you need to connect this part directly to this. Just you need to make this breakout board for DMD two. Adeno and one more I need to connect your ground pin so since I know that this one is your ground and the and this line is my ground see this is your ground pin and I will connect this ground to your Adeno ground and then my first pin is this one brown this is my first pin so I will connect it to D9 of a Dino you know then second is your D6 then third is your D7 of a of a Dino then yellow one or the fourth one is D13 this is your 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Connect it to D13. Then your D8. And the, the last one is D11. 10, 11. So that's all in the DMD part. Let's connect our Bluetooth module to Adeno. So to connect Bluetooth module, we will use ground VCC, TX and RX 
and we will connect this TX, TX and RX to our serial software serial uh, pins and and I will write the software serial using your second and third means your D2 and D3 pin D2 will be my RX pin so I will connect TX of means this gray one TX to second number pin means your TX of Bluetooth will connect to pin number 2 of Arduino and RX of Bluetooth will connect to 3 number pin of Arduino since 2 and 3 are receiver and transmitter of software serial then VCC ground will provide VCC and ground that's all see sorry VCC and ground done now let's connect our USB cable to your computer open your program then go to your tools and select your board here you can see that I am using Arduino Uno so I am selecting from board Arduino Uno and from port I am connecting to my port then upload the code now it's compiling it will take some second ok now it's uploading done yep. so something went wrong And this one is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, 13 is this one. Hmm, what happened? Okay, let me check. Brown is your first pin. Brown, red, then orange. Then 13, your yellow 13, then blue, then blue is your D8. Okay, I have interchanged the blue and green wire. Let me interchange this two pin. Okay, now you can see. Okay, now you can see your initial message is displaying as my engineering stuff fine uh, initial message will be displayed at the time of system start just open your android phone go to your play store and search for bt terminal here i am using this terminal bluetooth terminal for android just open it and it will ask to turn on your bluetooth so allow it then go to your option and connect as i know my bluetooth sc05 and having a mac address of 98d3 so i will connect it so whenever i will connect see the frequency of this led changes it means it got disconnected so because of the connection because of the loose connection actually let me reconnect it go to your and connect it now see you can see the frequency of this led increases sorry it decreases so and your initial message will be scrolling now what you will do you will type your message whatever you want to display hi friends let's suppose and send it 
whenever you are sending this message it will display after this message because the previous one is see hi friends so now this message will scroll to an infinite time till you didn't get the or you didn't uh, uh, send the next message so you can send uh, any message please See, now I have sent next next message. Please like, share, and subscribe my channel. Okay, so so by following this instruction, you can um, draw your or you can build your own wireless notice board. So, thank you for watching, guys.